Welcome back, everybody. It's 7 Ace of Tyon Alpha 21. This is an old guy gaming, and I am the Apocalypse Ranger series. What the hell? <laughs> little, little dyslexia there. Uh, you guys know what I mean, though. All right. Anyway, let's. Uh, we're gonna start this uh, quest here at the something rather happy in part happy apartments or whatever. And uh, this is a. Tier 5 infested, in other words, a tier 4 infested, which is technically considered a tier 5. Uh, because that's actually what it shows up as, as here. Um, and so that means this is just gonna be a clear, and I've I, I don't I don't think I've ever done this place. Ever. Period. Uh, so it should be interesting. Okay, so let's just jump right in and get this party started here. Don't see anything down in there. That's just a pipe sticking out of the place. Um, before we go inside, let's go. Let's go over here. That car's not lootable. I should have actually looted the cars first, but that's all right. It's kind of neat down here though now they got this set up has a little bit of a retro feel to it we can now make quality 5 smgs but it doesn't matter because we have purple smgs anyways the door's locked that door's locked Are we supposed to? Oh, okay. It looks like, <clears throat> excuse me. It looks like we're supposed to go up here. Cross over to this way. So this is the first time um, trying this in heavy armor. And we're still going to try and be stealthy and just see how well that works out for us. And, oh, incidentally. I, f I completely forgot, and I noticed this when I was editing the video. I completely tried again. Completely forgot to show how much uh, experience we got from the Horde Knights. So we just hit 24. So we we ended with 23, and we started with eight. Um. So what is that? 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. We have like 15 XP points on the Horde Knight. Where's that mountain lion at? Crazy, huh? Um, is that what the hell is he at? I don't even know where it's at. I think it's just right on the other side of the fence there. Okay, well, whatever. We don't care. Um, so yeah, we got a bunch of points here, and there. I don't know if there's really anything I care about anymore so much. Uh, we're just gonna. We're probably just going to end up putting points into everything. Animal Tracker, I mean, sure, why not? What the hell, right? Um, spears will probably be the very last thing we would put points into. Not that I don't like them. Um, I do. It's just that we haven't um, got Skull Crusher, right? Increase. Yeah, okay, let's do big and fast. So um, if and when we eventually use a Sledgehammer, we'll... We'll be able to do it quickly. Um, there's Pummel Pete. Huntsman. I mean, why not, right? And why not do cardio? What does that give us? 30% uh, stamina regen when sprinting. Okay. Agility. Whirlwind on Kniffies. Um, all right, maybe. Let's go back to Intellect. That's all for stun batons. This is completely useless to us because we're single player, right? Gain plus one. Does that does that count for me too? Um, let's let's see. I I don't think it does. Does it? You'd think it would also. Oh, you know what I'll bet? 
uh, I'll bet it counts when you have someone else with you, but it probably doesn't when you're by yourself. And I wonder if the game would consider the NPCs as eh, probably not because I think you have to go in and actually make them like an ally. So I don't know. So we're really, that's it, you guys. I mean, there's just nothing else to put points into that I give a shit about, to be honest with you. Um, I suppose what we could do is we've got everything in fortitude. Uh, we could do Pummel Pete. Well, we might mess around with clubs at some point. Okay, so strength is completely done. Perception is completely done except for spears. Fortitude is completely done. Agility is completely done except for Whirlwind. So let's just put points in Whirlwind because why not? And Intellect is completely done except for Stun Batons and Charismatic Nature. So this from this point forward, we're just going to put points into Spear and, and Quick and Perspective. Uh, uh, perceptive, rather. And don't don't really care after that what, what we do with points. We're pretty much maxed out. Okay, so I see a couple red dots. Our stealth meter's still showing us reasonably stealthy. Okay, well, that was a pretty quiet kill. And then we've got somebody else over here. He did. All right, got explosives and wiring. Very good. He doesn't have our our bolt. That fridge is not lootable. It's also blocking a door, it looks like. But since this is our first time going through, uh, we will we'll, we'll follow the the intended path. Alright, so we go through here. Possibly yeah, it's gonna say possibly somebody in that closet. Okay, so far, I'm not super impressed with these. I mean, they certainly attack quickly, and they do a reasonably good job of knocking them down because of the weighted head mod, but I'm, I still would have absolutely annihilated both those Zeeks if I would have had a sledgehammer. So, I don't know, we'll see. We'll, we'll use them for the rest of this POI anyways, and then we'll kind of assess from there. And besides, I don't even have a sledgehammer at the moment. Okay, he's down. A couple of red dots over here. Okay, that takes care of everybody in this area. I'm just going to pretty much loot everything and I'll throw out the crap we don't need once we get full. So that way we can just keep moving here. It is not lootable. Did we check that? Yeah, we did. Okay. He's out there killing Zika Ruse. Yeah, 
Yeah, see, I would have, I would have had that guy on his ass and dead by now with a sledge. Okay. Um, you know, the knuckles are probably fine for early to mid game, but when you're dealing with this kind of guy, that was completely ineffective. <laughs> I mean, it was just not even worth mentioning, we'll say. So, all right, well, you know, at least we know. It is handy to be able to do that with them, but of course you can do the same thing with a knife too, so. Okay, let's go over this way. Okay, well, we got a head headshot there. We're knocking him down, but we're not killing him as a thing. Yeah. Well, thing is, is at least we can say we tried, right? We gave him a good try, so... We'll just have to be on the lookout for... Are we, wait, are we supposed to go down there? Before we do, let's finish out this room here. There's nothing in this shower. Big mama. All right. Okay, so we have a light telling us to go out this way. But I'm a little confused about this. There is a bag down there. And there's this kind of a bag, too. Oh, wow, look at that. We're really starting to find some good loot in these drops. Um, It's not as good as what we have, so we can use it as a backup or, or sell it. Okay, let's check this here. What's up, National Guardsman? Can we get back up here with our parkour? Just about. All right, we'll just put a, a frame down. Or not. There we go. Okay, let's go out this way. Probably going to be some zombies in that closet there. Let's see, we've got a, an abrasion, uh, but it's only four minutes out. Okay. I think we'll save a, a first aid kit unless things get significantly worse. A little miso soup action there. And I think that's it for the kitchen. Doors locked. Handyland. Still have another red dot. Are they stuck? Oh, he's up here. Okay, I think it wants us to go up, but let's go down first and just see what's down here. Oh, nice. 
Uh, fireman's helmets and take 5% less damage. Okay. And then we'll we'll keep our our level 6 a SWAT helmet. The door's locked. And we're doing pretty good on inventory space. Okay, let's go up. Little construction going on in here. And, <clears throat> excuse me, four red dots. So let's see if we can get some sneaky sneaks. Yeah, so far the stealth still seems to be pretty reasonable, even with this heavy armor on. Okay, we just got his attention. All right, he did. Construction box, mo power, wiring and two traps, and some robotics. Uh, we need to find, though, uh, start finding magazines so that we can make uh, the turrets, because we maxed out in it now. We are hungry. Let's just eat these two things to get them out of the way. We want to save the stock and the chili. Um, we can eat the miso, but none of that's going to get our food back up, so we'll just throw back a shepherd's pie. And we'll take one red tea as well. Okay. Doesn't look like there's anything out there. Oh, I brought some timed charges with me. Figured we'd try those out on the next safe we come across just for the hell of it. Red dots. Some books. Salvage tools. We can now make an impact driver quality two and shotguns. We can make a pump shotgun quality two. We're probably gonna get ganked here. I just have that feeling. Yep, there they are. All right. Come on over, boys and girls. Just one? You stuck? Apparently he was. Uh, there's clubs. We're going to probably start seeing more of those books now that we put points into it. I mean, you know, if we come across like a really high-end steel club, we could certainly give it a try. No reason not to. But I don't think it's going to be as effective as the sledgehammer will be. We look all over here, yeah. Yeah, these things work well against normal zombies, but they're just 
not impressed with them against um, anything tougher. Are these going to be collapsing floors? No, I guess not. Oh, thanks for the assist, dude. He should be able to... Yep, get the kill and the red dot goes away. Oh, we got more. I'm still alive. There we go. Totally softened her up, though. <laughs> okay, I guess that's it for in here. Zombos. You guys stuck? Alright. We'll try our our knuckles out again. Screw this. Yeah, fuck these knuckles. <laughs> They're shit. Absolute shit. Oh, for Pete's sake, man. Absolute crap. Okay, up on the roof we go. Okay, it looks like the loot's over that way. Well, there's loot on both sides. So, where's the vultures? You know there's going to be some up here. There just has to be. All right, I see some greenies over there. Um, there's also... A fuel barrel. So we have no choice but to do this. Okay, nice. That was fun. Okay, there's going to be another group of them. Whole bunch of red dots over. Oh shit! Here comes our vulture friend. And that's it. Okay. That was pretty easy. All things considered. Okay, there's the main loot. Let's get the other stuff first. Tools digest. I can tell you right now, I don't want that. In fact, yeah, let's just clean up because we're not going to have enough room for everything anyways. 
Uh, that's uh, not better than what we have. I don't really need the cloth, so I'm just going to throw it out. That's indeed what we're going to do. Don't care about the sandwiches. We got plenty of bones. We're throwing out the cloth, the coal, the iron, the lead, the nails, the paper. Um, the pipes. I think I'll get rid of that too. Don't care about that or that, and we'll keep everything else. Okay. Guess we'll just read. Oh my goodness, what is this? Security camera bundle. Is that worthless or what? At least a four. For us, but that is a lot of ammunition, though. That is a lot of ammunition. Okay, let's hold off on that first. Because uh, we might end up needing needing to make a couple of trips. Um, let's go check this loot over here. There we go. <laughs> There's our steel club. Okay, well, we might give it a try. This why not, right? Well, that's a nice find. Very nice find. But uh, nowhere near as good as the one we have. What's down here? Just the way out, maybe? Yeah, that's probably just the way out. Okay. Okay, let's see if we... Have enough room for all of this. We don't. Um, see, did I bring... I brought the dirt bike too, so we don't have a lot of room in there. Here, we can read this. I'll open this up later, and whatever's in it will probably... Well, it's probably going to have some switches and some other things that will be useful to us. <clears throat> um, but the rest of the stuff I need to drop off, so I'll meet you guys back up here, and we'll open up the, the main loot. And I also need to remember to put these on too. Luckies. And pop the eye candy, but we'll do that when we come back up. Where's my motorcycle? Okay, let's take the rest of this stuff. And just for shits and giggles, we're going to try these out. Oh, no. How do I do this? Just... Oh, like that. Okay, and then... I don't think I've actually used these before. How do I... Do I just right-click? Oh, shit. You got to set it first. I thought we were, like, remote detonated it. Okay, did that open it up? Nope. <laughs> it's still locked. Maybe... Can you not use these on these hardened chests? Let's try one more time. Yep, it does work. Okay. Oh, we got another one. Nice. Okay, we got a couple of uh, tools. We got another almanac. 25% more damage to blocks. Fireman's axe modification. Oh, that's actually really good for the axe. So, yeah, we'll make that and put that on our axe if I remember to do it. And we got to make room for three more items. We don't need one spring. We don't need three animal fat. And we could probably get away with tossing out 21 iron. There you go. All right, I'll meet you guys back over by the trader. And we'll do our turning. If you break it, you buy it. You think you're pretty smart now, don't you? Here's your pay, Einstein. Okay, the auger is worth 19. The SMG is worth 25. That is definitely what we're going to take just because it's the most valuable item. Um, let's drink this. And let's take a look and see what else he's got for jobs. So he's got three tier sixes. 
I've got just the job for a simpleton. We haven't tells done the sunset. No who's still living. Get this son of a bitch out of. Let's make a pact. We haven't done he Red Mesa. These are the same ones he had before, I think, aren't they? Or got shit for brains to cross me. Hey, jerk, you need some work. Yeah, those are the same ones. Okay. We were stupid. Nobody turns me down. I think. Here. Okay, I'll tell you what I think we're gonna do. Why don't we? Why don't we start doing some jobs for Hugh? So just so we can work up to his higher levels and even Jin too for that matter. Jin's just in the town a little ways over. Um and you know there's still there's still several lower level POIs that I have not done. So with them not so much for the challenge but more just for the for the funsies. <laughs> you think he goofed? Nice. Um, yeah, so let's go over to Trader Hugh. And uh, start, just start doing jobs for him. Just, again, for the, the hell of it. And uh, to maybe do some new lower level POIs that we haven't done yet. Because that apartment building that we just did, I had never done that before. So it was kind of fun to see it. And you know, it wasn't uh, wasn't really that challenging, but it was fun to do. No loitering. All right, let's take a look at his inventory just for the hell of it. We will buy these three vehicle books. So let's sell him something. Do we have any like cash we could sell him? No, it doesn't look like it. Um, I don't want to sell many mods because we can put those on stuff. Uh, here, yeah, let's sell these boots. Okay. And that's really pretty much about it. Uh, that's all you're going to buy. I'll let you show yourself out. Okay, let's read these. And then... We... Oh... <laughs> We're going to have to do tier ones for him. I mean, it is what it is. Uh, so the name of the game here is to do a POI that we haven't done yet. So otherwise, I just don't really care. Get time to do some Marvin's chores. Getaway. That doesn't sound familiar. Good. We're going to do Marvin's Getaway. Okay. All right, guys. Well, we are out of time in this episode. So I'm going to go back to the base, drop all this crap off. Um, what I think we'll do is in the next episode is... We will, um, I don't have any room for anything. I was going to, okay, hold on a second. Um, we have one spot there. We have leather. So let's, um, harvest this guy. I think it's probably mostly the bones. Oh, we want the testosterone too. So let's ditch. I got a shit ton of corn. I got a shit ton of blueberries. Let's just drink a beer. Okay. And, oh, I guess we haven't read the book yet. I want the testosterone. Okay, the rest of this stuff is just bones and stuff we don't absolutely have to get. Okay. Well, that sucks. I did... <laughs> I thought we had read that book, but I guess not. Um, what was I saying? What well, I think maybe what we'll do in the next episode is we'll we'll sell because I got a bunch of stuff to sell, and um, then we'll go do this this new tier one quest, and then depending upon how our time goes, maybe we'll hit a second tier one quest. Uh, so I think that's it for this episode, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode, and if you did, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share the video. Oh, and we'll also try out clubs. Uh, in the next episode too for our melee weapon but i'm definitely getting rid of these knuckles they're just uh, very underwhelming okay goodbye